Hello everyone, welcome to Baiju's exam prep, India's most comprehensive preparation platform. So here I am to guide you what are the top 20 colleges in India or the universities in India for MTech. Because uh, I have done uh, you know MTech from IIT Guwahati and I am having more than 12 year experience in the field of GATE. So I can guide you better uh, to how to take the admissions and what can be the different uh, colleges where you will get the placement and you should take the admission if you are looking for the MTech. Apart from the IITs and NITs, there are few other colleges where you get the good placement and also the good research exploration. So that is very important to understand what other than IIT we can get and if we are having the IITs, then what are the IITs we have to choose and is there any importance of the IIT tag or it can be done in the NIT and other colleges also. If we go for the research, then what are the important criteria that we should look for? This is all we are going to discuss. So first of all, whenever we, uh, you know, do the gate examination when we give and when we uh, enter into the MTech admissions, then there are certain criteria in different different colleges. Uh, few universities or colleges takes their own exam and few will directly shortlist by the gate exam and uh, some will be having both. Means they will shortlist by gate and then they will take their separate exam. So here we are going to discuss first those who are going to take the admission directly through the gate examination and uh, what can be your uh, uh, sequence of taking the admission and it depends on the branch also obviously when uh, we are uh, see the mtech we are only looking for mtech no we are also looking for the branch wise that uh, suppose in the electronics the vlsi is the topmost branch then uh, even with the uh, iit wise if we have to uh, somewhat compromise through the uh, name like uh, if i compare with the IIT Bombay with the any of the new IIT then um, maybe if you are more interest if you have keen interest on VLSI then you can compromise uh, uh, with the IIT Bombay and you can go for uh, according to your interest in the some of new IITs with the specific branch that is VLSI because after that you will get the good exposure because uh, it is uh, also possible that uh, not only from the placement, there may be a chance of off campus also you can apply and you can get the good job if you have the MTech with your interest. Because if you will have interest on that particular specialization, then you will do some more research on that and that is why you will have good project in your hand and you have also the good project knowledge and that actually important when you go for the placement through the MTech, it is important that whether you are doing the, uh, when you do the MTech project, whether you are doing it with the interest or just for the sake of uh, IIT or just for sake of this MTech, you are doing that project. So both are very different thing and that you should always keep in mind. So this is Saket Verma and I'm having more than 12 year experience. I have done MTech from signal processing through IIT Guwahati. I have got different PSU exams as well. And uh, I am having this subject of interest. Uh, if you are from electronics, then you might be knowing about it. And uh, these are the signals and system, advanced communication system, etc. These are my area of interest. Okay. So now, we all know that if we talk about the best college of MTech, then we always look for the ISC. But ISC does not uh, have very good placement or they are not having interest on the placement because they are more oh, inclined towards the research, obviously. So when you do the research, when you have good project in your hand, anyone will pick you. So it does not matter whether you placed through the ISC or not. But you, once you come out in the market and when you show your degree from ISC, then every uh, single company will be ready to take you if you have the good project with the 
good knowledge and with the good CPI. So IIT Bangalore, IIT Bombay, IIT Delhi, IIT Madras, IIT Kharagpur, and IIT Kanpur. These are the top IITs through which we should always look for the MTech. Apart from the branch, also we can look. If you can, if you want to, uh, you know, uh, suppose you have the other interest apart from the VLSI or your thermodynamics or any of your branch, maybe geology. Uh, so it depends on the second option also there will be one other option where you may have interest like if i am a electronics student then i may have the interest uh, apart from the uh, vlsi i may have interest on the signal processing so uh, if i am getting the signal processing in isc bangalore not in the suppose uh, vlsi then also i can go for the isc iit bombay or iit delhi it depends on my interest my second priority so these are the top IITs where you can do the mtech so you can say uh, this is all iit comes under the gate examination only they only uh, take uh, admissions in the mtech through the gate examination and some of these iits will have the ms program also and the self sponsor ms program also so uh, whenever it will come and uh, for few iits it has already been come so Whenever it will come, I will all I will all again come here to guide you that uh, if there is any self-sponsored MTech program and if you don't have any financial issue but you have interest to do the MTech from the top IITs, then you can go for that. Next is the best colleges for MTech is IIT Guwahati, IIT Turki. These are all old IITs, and apart from this, there are top NITs like NIT. Trichy, NIT, Varangal, NIT, Surat, actually, uh, and NIT, Calicut. So these are the four top NITs from where you can do the MTech. Like if you want to do the MTech only in the VLSI, only in your specialization, main specialization, any branch, then you can go for these NITs because these NITs are also having very good placement. Even more package you can get from few IITs to new IITs and even in fact uh, over these IITs also you can get the good package IIT Guwahati, IIT Rurki you can have better package than these IITs in this NIT NIT Trichy, Varangal these are known for the very good uh, placement and also the in fact their top branch closes before the thousand rank okay so these are few uh, NITs where you can go and uh, very important and very interesting uh, we have is BITS Plani. BITS Plani is also very good placement. It, they give the internship in the company so you will have very good exposure in your project. Uh, so in the IITs we don't get any internship program. You have to do the MTech in the IIT itself but the BITS Plani is the one of uh, top colleges in India where when you do the MTech, you will also get the practical exposure. You will be doing the project in the real life in a project. Okay, so that will be very good exposure, very good learning, and that is why they get the easy placement in any company. So bits planning you can look for, and bits planning also takes the admission through the two different mode. One is through the gate, and they have their separate higher degree examination that have the course syllabus same as the gate so and in the bits planning when you go through the gate examination you will get the higher stipend than the iits because the bits planning itself gives their own stipend and you also get the stipend through the mhrd so you will get the double stipend around 30 35000 so uh, the fees is high in this bits planning so that is why uh, the high stipend will give you the financial support so you can go for the bits planning because after all uh, eventually you get the good placement through the bits plan niti mumbai if you are if you are interested in going through the management side through the gate then niti mumbai is for you and triple it bangalore and triple it hyderabad they also have very good placement and this is the college where you can do the mtech and they also have their separate exam so you can go for the triple ITs also that is especially Hyderabad and Bangalore then coming to new NITs and uh, 
these NITs, you can also go, uh, there are also spe specific branch. Suppose the VLSI you are doing, then VLSI and communication branch, then you can go for these NITs also. Because uh, some special branch which has the good future and in that future, uh, in that particular branch, if you do the MTech from, in fact, the new NITs also, then also uh, you will have the good future because you have the degree in the uh, field where the projects are very coming and that is demanding. Okay, like a data science and artificial intelligence, if you do the MTech in this field, then also it will be very useful and you will be in demand near future. So apart from NITs, IITs and triple IITs, we have uh, IIT, ISM, Dhanbad, ISI, Kolkata, also VIT, Mishra and VIT, VIT also there. Okay, VIT Valor is also there. They also have the good placement. One of my students just got placed through the VIT Valor and uh, that is through uh, in the Intel, I guess. So, you can go in the intel uh, through the vit valor also so they also have their separate exam you can go and you can uh, appear on that and uh, you can do mtech vjti mumbai is also very famous college that is government college and that is also very famous college for doing mtech coe pune that is the college of engineering pune is also very good college old college and uh, known for their uh, MTech in, and they have also have the decent uh, placement. So apart from IITs, NITs, few of NITs, you have few colleges like Bits Pilani or Bits, all over Bits, uh, Bits Pilani, Goa and Hyderabad. And then you can go for Valur, you can go for BIT Mesha, you can go for VJTI Mumbai, you can go for COE Pune, you can also go for Delhi University, that is Netaji Shubhash Chandra University. Okay, that is also a uh, very good college for doing mtech if you want a decent uh, placement so uh, i think i have already told you that uh, what are the different colleges and one more college i can write is diat pune that is the college of drdo and uh, they also offer to the mtech program and uh, the very low rank students can also do the MTech like 2000, 3000 rank students can also do the MTech through this DIAT Pune. That is the college from the DRDO and uh, you may get the opportunity to do your project in the DRDO and uh, they that will give you the exposure. Obviously, you will not get placed in the DRDO because DRDO has their own uh, recruitment criteria. So, but the project you will be doing in the very, uh, in the DRDO lab itself and uh, um, off campus you can try so these are the top colleges because i have covered more than 20 colleges because if i count the iits and it's then itself they are more than 20 and apart from that i have already covered the vit mishra isi kolkata iit bhu uh, and uh, sorry uh, vjti mumbai coe pune delhi university vit Velo, diit pune and bits plan so these are the other university or colleges from where you can do your Okay, thank you for watching this session and uh, all the very best for your result.